something from Galway City of Film. Right. Well, <laughs> tomorrow's December the 1st, and it's exactly a year ago to the day since Galway um, became a UNESCO City of Film and joined the Creative Studies Network. It's a very res significant responsibility for us in Galway Film Centre and something we take very seriously. This week we produced a very simple little booklet uh, which explains what it is, why we got it, and what it means. There's no City Council logo, there's no County Council logo, there's no Galway Film Centre logo. The reason for this is this logo is all of us together. This is a collective endeavour. This is strength in numbers. This is us achieving together what none of us could do on our own. If you take the three words, Galway, Fulham and UNESCO, as far as we're concerned, there's only one man for the job. Um, they're three of his favourite things and three things he knows more about than the rest of us in the room. So will you, ladies and gentlemen, will you please welcome our President of Ireland, Michael De Higgins. <laughs> About 30 years ago, looking back at us, I have been too long. We owe so much to those independent <coughs> minded people who wanted to explore this art form, who said it is something that we should have. You should see people making these great films and so forth. It's true to say that the 80s into the 90s, that film as practiced was kept alive by people giving each other loans of equipment, pieces and so forth. Film is never a commodity. Uh, we actually lose something in the world uh, when it is seen only as that. It's a powerful art form. It has potential as a cultural expression of both memory and imagination. It's so important that no matter what you do, that you'll be able to realize yourself and your dignity and your human purpose of what you're doing. It's some people want to do with excellence and get a great buzz from, even if no one ever looked at it. <laughs> I think that it is there. Uh, Really, people should draw now from what was just forged into this the rock of through the film industry and work on creating not just a, a creative city, a film city, but a creative region. I remember uh, persuading Lilia to become first chair of the, the Irish Film Board. Uh, uh, what, a, what, a, what a unleash is great. <laughs> <laughs> I would like now to call on the Chair of Galway Film Centre, Stephen Horton, um, to present the President of Ireland, Michael D. Higgins, with a specially commissioned silver brooch from Galway jeweller, Marina Kelly, who is also here with us today. Thank you, Stephen. <laughs> to meet us here again next year to celebrate the second year of us becoming a UNESCO Creative City. But I don't want to meet here. I want to meet in a fully furnished, fully functional, fully operational going into the house.